welcome back to the show. This beautiful piece of art that you're looking at was made by everyone's favorite Edmontonian elephant, Lucy. And now we're talking all about this year's Zoo Fest. It's so exciting. And I'm joined by Monica Zenyuk, and she's here to talk all about what's happening. So first off, it's next weekend. What do you got in store for everyone? We'd like to invite all the Shaw viewers to join us down at the zoo. It's an evening after hours, mainly geared towards grown-ups because of the mature adult nature of the okay. food and the beverage that's okay. taking place. But they're only $75 for the tickets. From 6.30, the gates open and they're in for some, few, some nice surprises. Including Lucy painting on location. There's going to be a number of her paintings auctioned off. When you brought this and you said, this is Lucy's painting, I thought, okay, it's a local artist I don't know of. But no, Lucy herself paints. So that that is just the visually stimulating part of this that I need to wrap my head around so how does Lucy paint well it's part of her enrichment program and it is something that she does enjoy doing it uh, is something that she chooses the time length that she wants to do it and okay. she chooses the colors Very so cool. she does have a distinct uh, muse mm -hmm. in her style and she'll paint for a couple of minutes or she'll paint for a couple of hours it's up to her very nice this whole zoo fest it's a big fundraiser and it's part of the zoo's long-term plan for developing something very special it has been a children's themed show here on Shaw TV today so talk about what's what's in store for the zoo well there's actually a master plan and it's in three phases and the Valley Zoo Development Society has committed to raising nine million dollars that's going towards phase three phase three called nature's wild backyard mm. and what that consists of it's the brand new children's zoo where our littlest guests and their families they're going to be able to get up close and personal with some of the more cuddlier animals such as the red pandas tortoises skunks squirrel monkeys they'll learn about their habitats where they come from their enrichments their food mm -hmm. all the things that are associated with those types of animals excellent okay and speaking of other types of animals Lucy's not the only one that's going to be painting, is she? That's right. Hula is our beloved harbor seal. She's six years old, also part of her enrichment. She will take a brush into her mouth and she will do paintings as well. Her live painting that evening will be auctioned off, but we will have some other examples for the guests to bid on. Perfect. Is there anything else that we didn't mention so far that our viewers at home should know about, about this year's Zoo Fest? Uh, it is the 13th anniversary, so lucky 13. There we go. That's correct. The new zoo that we're building is going to be more focused on education and conservation. So we've actually pushed the fence back about 80 acres and they're recreating the landscape of the North Saskatchewan River starting with the Columbia headwaters. So the water's going to actually flow, flow through an aspen forest, a boreal forest. It'll eventually culminate up to a brand new entrance where there will be a zoo school cafe, gift shop, the river otters are going to be relocated there. But when they arrive at Zoo Fest that night, they'll be greeted with some sparkling wine, champagne. Then there's five food stations with wine pairings that's going to take place as well. We'll have some entertainment. Firefly acrobats are going to be there doing some of their, showing off their skills yeah. in the air. And there'll be a lot of roving zookeepers with animals so that people can get up close and personal. Another feature that's new this year is you'll be able to have your photo taken privately with either Lucy, Hula, or a spectacled owl named Cortez, and that's for minimum donations. Perfect, okay, so there's so much information. Definitely a night that you can't miss out on. For more information to buy tickets, where do people go? Go to www.buildingourzoo.com. Excellent, thanks so much, Monica. We'll be right back here on Shaw TV.